set up your equipment as shown. Add three drops of phenylphthalein to the citric acid solution in the beaker. Ensure the tap on the burette is shut and using a funnel, pour the solution of sodium hydroxide into the burette. Do not spill the solution onto the skin. Slowly titrate the sodium hydroxide into the citric acid solution using the burette. Care must be taken that the sodium hydroxide is dropped directly into the solution and does not touch the glass, otherwise the reading may be false. While titrating, care must be taken to continually swirl the solution in the beaker to keep it thoroughly mixed. This is essential, particularly when the solution nears neutrality. It is important to determine the point of neutrality or the end point of titration very exactly. The phenylphthalein indicator changes very rapidly from colourless to pink and the end point can easily be missed which will give an inaccurate reading for the test. It is important therefore that towards the end of the titration the sodium hydroxide is added a drop at a time. Using phenylphthalein as an indicator, the point of neutrality is reached when the indicator changes from colourless to pink. The indicator colour must remain stable, persisting for 30 seconds, and be light pink when viewed over a white background. However, the shade can vary depending on the type of juice being tested. If the point of neutrality is missed, i.e. the colour of the indicator is too dark, the test must be repeated. Repeat the whole process with bottled lemon juice.